a celebration for the nonprofit Street Roots. The purchase of this building means expansion for the houseless people they serve. The organization creates income opportunities. Those struggling with homelessness buy newspapers at 25 cents each from street routes, then sell them to the public for a dollar and keep the difference. This building is an $8 million project. It's going to be renovated and feature classrooms, a job training center, laundry services, and showers. So this building, you know, we're really interested in how it can support a holistic approach where we're meeting foundational needs things people really need, but we're not forgetting that they dream. Inside this building, Street Roots vendors will have access to an office where they can buy newspapers to sell, grab some coffee, and have access to a library. Brandon Hayward has been homeless since 2013. He works with Street Roots from time to time. So they give us the opportunity to let us know what it's like to be somebody, and they give us to start with the with the legit job. It's legit pay. We don't have to go out and steal from people with addictions no more. We just sell papers and talk to people. And we get donations. Street Roots will completely move into this building by November. They still need to renovate it and raise another one million dollars. This project is four years in the making. Hayward has come a long way, and he credits his current success to Street Roots. I'm I. I've been blessed. I'm cleaned up now. I'm not, I'm not on meth. Um, I sell street roots um, and I, I smile every day because of street roots. If people want to help donate to street roots to help finish this project, we'll post a link on our website, kgw.com. Brittany. All right, Brian, thanks so much.